Hello guys, how you doing? So, I'm going to watch episode 2 of the One Piece live action today. And it was um, really entertaining, the, the first episode of this series. I really enjoyed everything about it, like from the interactions um, between each actor and uh, the way they, they played the character, they were really perfect. Um, and um, everything is looking really good, like, um, like the whole... Um, like all the places and how everything looks like, it looks uh, pretty much um, like, of course it's never going to be exactly like in the anime, but it's uh, easy to recognize um, the places that they created. Um, and um, it's looking uh, really good so far, so I'm really excited about this, I want to see more of the, um, of the other characters, I'm expecting um, to meet uh, Usopp and uh, perhaps uh, Buggy during uh, um, this episode. Um, but yeah, just really can't wait to start uh, watching it. So, hope you guys are ready and let's do it. Oh. We seem practicing. Hmm. Yeah, it's been a thing. People reacting to his power. And I mean in the anime. Like the enemies <laughs> learning about how it works. Can swim. Oh, not wrong. Considering what I know now. <laughs> also, this kid is playing it really well. Like Luffy as a child. Hmm. I don't know if it's going to happen now, that whole situation with Luffy messing with the bandits and Shanks losing a, the arm. Expecting them to show it. Oh, that's not me. <laughs> Man, that's really cool. Just like Luffy. Damn. Hmm. I wonder if she can do the shark tease. <laughs> that would be really funny. Like Nami's trademark. <laughs> oh That's true And they're going wild with these rants. But it's pretty typical from the Starlight Pirates, so it's 
it's really nice that they they're doing it like this. Oh, there's Rose. Want that poster? Oh, he's going to. <laughs> I'm trying to read it. He really needed Nami. The one million dollar question. <laughs> I remember this from the trailer. It got some buggy, right? Yeah. Oh my god, he's... <laughs> That's really awesome. It's some of these moments that are hard to remember. These small details. But it's pretty cool to see it. Oh, damn, the logo with Buggy. That's really nice. They, them having a different logo for each kind of arc. Still as yet. She's so mad. Inside of him. Not Marines, though. I mean, I'm not too sure about that. The ones always going after them, the Marines, their aim is terrible. It's a good kind. Hmm. Oh, here we go. Oh, there's that guy. Damn. I'm not too sure, but. I'm kind of expecting them to have uh, hired professionals to do this, like the ones who perform at circuses and stuff. Some of those things are not easy to do.
<laughs> the spotlight. <laughs> the clown guy. <laughs> Pinky. <laughs> They even did this, like, messing up the names. A classic. <laughs> hmm. Oh yeah, these! I was like a bit confused, but he, he did this! <laughs> yeah, he got triggered every time. Even when they didn't even mention the nose. Just something similar. <laughs> Trying to see if she got the joke. <laughs> Man, he's playing it so well. <laughs> My God. I actually wonder what he's doing right now in the story. Like in the anime. It's been a while since I saw him. Hmm. Is he about to do it? Yeah, Zoro against the Buggy is kinda a bad matchup. My god, those teeth. Luffy. <laughs> oh. And she's gone. Oh, I remember this part from the trailer too. Yeah, that's a buggy for you. I still remember him with those, like, cannonballs, destroying everything. That was pretty insane. Well... I 
I'm just like really looking forward to see to see him using his power. I saw a bit in the trailer, but I want to see more of it. Oh, oh that's Kobe. Starting his life as a marine. Oh, that guy. The one who Nami sold the uh, clothes from. <laughs> the the ad piece looks really funny. Hmm. This is really interesting because, like, knowing what happened between Kobe and El Mepo after. They got really close to each other. Really nice that they're showing these moments too. What's left of it? She does too. It was really wild learning about what Nami was going through. I never thought it would be like that when I first started watching this. She's prepared. <laughs> that buggy. What was that, Luffy? Oh, it's Luffy. Oh my god, they're stretching him like... But it's amazing how they're able to do this. Hmm. And this music reminds me a lot of um, Inception. There's a song like really similar. Like the notes used. <laughs> His face. <laughs> Always smiling. He's not even feeling anything. I don't remember if he mentioned Shanks or not. But I believe he did, right? Because Buggy and Shanks, they were together <laughs> before, so... And I think he got really triggered when Luffy mentioned his name. Oh. 
So he knew already because of the ad. Are they going to show that? I don't know if they would show them like at a younger age. Man, he, he just looks so good as Bucky, it's like, <laughs> really funny. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> Boogie. <laughs> this never gets old. <laughs> My God. Yeah, they won't. Love so badly. Oh, he's getting out. Yeah, clearly, he's guy. <laughs> oh. And there he goes. <laughs> oh my god. Are they going to have the... Yep. Man, this is so crazy. It's incredible how they did this. Damn! Man, that's... I'm just so amazed. Oh. <laughs> My god. His power is something else. And I know I've been saying this a lot, but... I never imagined they could do something... like this. Of course, like, technology is, has advanced a lot. They can do a lot of things in movies and such. But still, like, seeing this, it's, it's like, special. Yeah, this fight. <laughs> My god. Always with rents ready. Oh, this was a sink. I remember that this guy was really hard to to defeat. Hmm.
And I just love the look on his face. It's like classic Zoro. Always with that... Not exactly serious face, but the face of someone who doesn't care, like... It's really funny. Oh, Nami is... Unlocking that. Oh, back to Kobe. Oh my, he's actually feeding. Wait, did this happen in the anime? I can't really remember them feeding the transponder snails. Maybe it happened in this scene? Not too sure. I mean, they're snails, so they need to eat. So it makes sense. Man, this guy playing... He's playing Kobe perfectly. Hmm. Also don't remember when Garp finds out about how it was Luffy. My god, this guy. He's a really good Garp as well. Luffy. Yep. That's him, your grandson. And seeing this is like making me remember all of those moments when they cross paths later in the story. It was always like, this was like the start of the story, so it's, it's something like really nostalgic. Like this relationship between Kobe and Luffy and how things happened later on. Oh, now these. It's finally about to happen. Hmm.
these guys had no idea who they were messing with. Hmm. There it is. Oh. I was actually like wondering if it was like the... How was it called? Like the six powers finger pistol or something? But it was the other guy shooting this time. Oh my god! <laughs> Wait, did that actually happen? It's these things that I can't remember, like these details. The Rikushi and stuff. That was cool. But yeah, meanwhile, the other guy took Luffy to the boat, right? It's back to present time. Yeah, that's not good. Can't use his powers. And this place, though. It's also a bit hard for me to remember how things look like exactly during this part of the story. Hmm. Never a good idea to do this to Luffy. <laughs> He's guy. Hmm. About that. Sure. Not too sure, but is it Zoro who cuts the glass or something? I'm not too sure how Luffy gets out of that situation. Shanks is coming. Oh, that's the Sea King. Damn.
Yeah, that guy is not going to have a great time. He's remembering this. It's like a similar moment, that's what I mean. But then Shanks shows up. Man, it looks so good. Scary, but good. Oh! Wait, did it happen already? Or is it now? The Aki is doing it. He already lost his arm. Man, that was something. Seeing this seeking... It was really well done. Hmm. Yep. This was really shocking the first time I watched it. How just like that you lost an arm. You fall asleep. Wait. For a moment I thought it cut the ropes. Hmm. Damn. That line though. Oh, he's going to use it to, to cut it. <laughs> he's not laughing anymore. <laughs> Sounds straightforward enough. <laughs> Behind him. Oh, it's Nami! With her weapon? Breaking it! <laughs> I love how he was also washed away. Buggy. Oh, it's coming out. Hmm. Is this when he starts like... Yeah, this. Using his power a lot. Man, that's so cool. Yeah, this moment is from the trailer.
Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Not a good matchup. Man, this is so well done. Probably one of the most impressive powers in this live action. But I will have to see the rest. And I mean in terms of like... Kinda animating the power. Making it just like the anime. Just like what Cheng said. This is a development I always loved. Oh. Just like that. Oh, this part! Oh... Oh, they're going to put the pieces there, right? <laughs> His face. That's like one less piece to worry about. Just locking all the pieces away. <laughs> oh yeah, these! <laughs> Man, that looks so funny. I couldn't remember this happening as well. But now I do. Well, that's literally how the trailer ended. The one I watched. Bazooka! <laughs> and there he goes. Man, that's just so cool. Watching all of these powers. Kinda in real life. Imagine, act imagine actually having those. It's not over yet. It's going back to this. I'm assuming the guy behind him is the one I mentioned before. The one who got fooled by Nami. Oh no, it's it's Morgan, never mind. Yeah, this doesn't actually happen. I guess I guess they're like done with the one from before. Oh, 
Oh yeah, they go together. Morgan and Garp. And everyone, like including El Mepo and Kobe. And that's when they split, I think. At some point when they are in the ship. I remember that dog. I think. Like this vague idea. That's something. <laughs> Luffy not accepting food. Oh, well, maybe. <laughs> Just one. <laughs> or two. <laughs> Typical Luffy. I was expecting to see Usopp during this one, but I guess it's going to happen during the next one. I couldn't remember if meeting Usopp was before or after they met Buggy. Again, this this happened so long ago, it's... Unless you rewatch it, it's hard to remember. Like, pretty much everything. Oh, they're going to show this scene. This is, this is such a... Like a... A classic one. Shanks putting the hat on top of his head. Hmm. Just like that. This was such an iconic scene. I just really love the way they're doing everything. Like going back and forth, showing a bit of everything. And now they're getting closer. It was really cool to see how they they came to be so close to each other, even like when they didn't want to. They never wanted to be part of his crew, but they they changed their minds because of what happened and seeing how Luffy really is.
It's still some things before, but... Hmm. Oh, it's like a... I don't remember who she was. Oh, he's telling the Arlong pirates, okay. Yeah, like, I believe Nami is with them when they meet Usopp. But then when they're going for the Barassi, where Sanji is, that's where she, like, sort of betrays them, right? I'm like waiting for that moment. But yeah, I don't remember if in the anime there was like this. Uh, I don't know the name of it. Like, it's not uh, the usual transponder snail, it's like one you put in your ear. I mean, this was another really good episode. I really enjoyed these moments with Buggy. Not too sure, but I'm probably not going to see more of him during this series. At least his first season. I really hope there's more seasons after. But it was really well done. I'm just so impressed. Like how they were able to... To show his power in, in like perfection. It looks really... Just really good exactly like in the anime. Really amazing work. And like I said before, the amount of people they had to... To get, to... To make this possible... It's unbelievable. And they did a great job picking... Like the the best actors for each role, they really they are really doing a great job playing their characters. I really like the soundtracks. There was that specific one that like the melody. It really reminded me of that popular one from Inception. If you guys know it. Of course, it's not the same song, but just makes me remember it. The first note is pretty much the same. But yeah, I'm looking forward to see what's going to... Not what's going to happen, but what they're going to show next, during the next episode. This time, I'm expecting it to be about Usopp. I don't know if there's going to be more or not, because... I mean, there's a whole lo lot more characters, of course. I'm talking about the ones from the, um, the Straw Hat Pirates. Um, but um, again, it's... They're probably going to show this whole arc involving um, Usopp and also um, like Kuro and the ones that they had to fight against. And also Kaya and... Um, that was her name, right? Kaya? I hope I'm not uh, misspelling it. Um, and then uh, them getting the Going Merry as well. I mean, that was one of the most important um, uh, moments uh, of this story. So I'm uh, expecting them to show um, all of that. And uh, it's probably going to be really amazing to see um, how they will um, like do everything in terms of the powers being used and such. I mean, seeing um, or like remembering Kuro, I remember that he fought with those um, like big blades as uh, his claws almost or like it's like his nails were these, um, these big, um, uh, like, uh, blades. Um, and, um, like, there was also um, that other guy who, like, uh, hypnotized the people, right? I can't remember the names of um, a lot of these characters, because it was, like, so long ago, and it's not like um, they showed up, um, uh, like, a whole lot afterwards, or th that they were mentioned. Um, but, yeah, it's uh, going to be interesting to see what... Um, 
they will do and stuff, how they will play in every single one of these uh, scenes. Um, but yeah, so far they have been doing a great job, uh, like showing uh, a bit of everything, not just the present time, but uh, also going back to show um, how it was with Luffy before and showing a lot of those uh, iconic scenes. I mean, that will, um, those uh, moments with um, Luffy seeing Shanks when he was a kid, that's literally one of the most um, important moments of this story, like showing uh, how Luffy. Like, got this dream of becoming uh, the king of pirates, how Shanks influenced him so much. So, I really enjoyed the fact that they showed, um, they showed these specific moments. Uh, and I'm just sad that uh, they didn't show a specific one, but uh, I guess it wouldn't, like, be... I mean, it's not like it wouldn't be easy, but um, I don't know if they even showed... Uh, that specific scene during um, this part of the story or not, it's hard to remember when exactly they uh, showed it. Uh, the one I'm talking about is when um, they showed the flashback of uh, Buggy um, and um, and um, uh, Shanks uh, when they were with uh, Goldie Roger. So I'm not too sure if they will still show it um, or not. Again, it's hard to remember when they did it uh, during um, the anime. Um, but yeah, either way, I'm just happy with everything so far and really can't wait to see uh, what they're going to show during, um, or like, again, how they will show everything during um, the next episode. So, with this, just hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this one. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. You can also join my Discord and my Patreon if you want to get early access to my full reactions. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.